Well, almost everyone has been touched by cancer in some way. I know my family certainly has. And the diagnosis can be a terrible burden, leaving patients and their families feeling frightened and powerless. But today we're going to show you how to take action and become an active part of the solution as part of our ongoing series, Fighting Cancer Now. We're talking to Lynette Bisconti, president of the Gateway for Cancer Research, and Rhonda Cocott, a Gateway board member who helped create Team Demand, a fundraising effort based on running events. Welcome, Lynette. Good to see you. Good to Hi, see Rhonda. you. Great Hi, to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. I want to start with you this morning, Lynette, because basically, yeah, we know what cancer is. It's been around for generations, and researchers have spent an awful lot of time and money looking for cures. So why is it still such a killer? Well, it's a killer because we need to shift the way that we're planning and funding research and the way that we're selecting the kind of research that we fund. Mm -hmm. We've spent a great deal of time and money doing very valuable research in gathering interesting information from laboratory science. It's time to take what we've learned in interesting information and translate it to the bedside of cancer patients with new treatment options today. Mm -hmm. And that's why the Gateway does what it does. We only fund that kind of research that funds that is about the cancer patient today helping cancer patients feel better, live longer, or be cured. What a great point, because if you're not helping that patient today, we don't know that that patient will be here tomorrow. If you're a stage four cancer patient, you do not have the luxury of time. And time is everything to a cancer patient and for those who love them. So we need options now. We need urgency now. One of the ways that you are helping today's uh, cancer patient is by reaching out to individuals um, and getting involved in a program that's called Team Demand. Tell me about that. Well, Demand Cures Today is the gateway for cancer research's tagline. And that comes out of my personal experience with cancer, having had cancer when I was pregnant, and me looking at my beautiful 13-year-old son today and looking at him and saying, enough, not another generation. And so Demand Cures Today is about getting demanding, funding the right kind of research, and putting urgency into this. So we created Team Demand as a way for everybody to get involved through running events, but through any event, to help raise money for this kind of cancer research. Wonderful, and so I wanna bring you in here now, Rhonda, because I understand that you got involved with Team Demand partly because of your own experience with cancer, right? Tell me a little bit about that. That's right, I was diagnosed with acute myeloid leukemia, which is an aggressive form of leukemia when I was 28 years old. 28? Yes, and almost immediately going through treatment, I knew that I would need a stem cell transplant if I had any hope for a cure. So I started do doing chemotherapy and ultimately went to the University of Minnesota where I learned about a clinical trial that was testing the use of umbilical cord stem cells in adult patients mm -hmm. for a transplant. Mm -hmm. I received those umbilical cord stem cells and 10 years later, I'm cured of my disease. So Yay. it's a, <laughs> That's it's wonderful. Just amazing. Oh, my a, goodness. a great milestone. But even early on, I knew that I wanted to do something with my with my experience to make it a positive impact on the world and on the, on the study of cancer. Mm -hmm. So I, be, I began running endurance events to raise money for cancer research. And this year I'm doing what I'm calling my 10-10-10 challenge, which is in my 10 year anniversary of my diagnosis, I'm running 10 races and raising $10,000 for the Gateway for Cancer Research. I think it's a wonderful thing that you all are doing. And I wanted to ask you, Rhonda, what would you say to women out there who may be going through what you went through and may be fearful right now and may not know where to turn or what to do or what next steps should be. What would your advice be? Yeah, I think cancer takes away a lot of control and mm -hmm. going through the process, it's really hard to see the light at the end of the tunnel. And I think you know, the most important thing is to just stay focused on your goal, which is the cure, which is to be here ah. another day. And even little milestones celebrate those things because ultimately, you're gonna be 10 years later looking back on your experience like me and knowing that it was all worth it. Absolutely, great advice, great way to end it. Roger, so good to meet you. Nice to meet you. Lynette, great to see you as always. Nice to see you. And if you wanna find out how to join Team Demand or to create your own fundraiser, simply visit the website, it's demandcures.org.